Yeah! Hola gang, and welcome again to Old Nerd Reviews. I'm Tony, I'm your old nerd of the day, and I try things so you don't have to. Today I am at Jack in the Box to try their brand new triple cheese and hash brown breakfast burrito. Now, I like Jack in the Box. They make things fresh. They have their breakfast menu 24-7, the entire menu. Um, so yeah, there's multiple reasons. Kind of middle of the road on price-wise but good food. So let's go to the clipboard of fluff. The Jack in the Box Triple Cheese Hash Brown Breakfast Burrito consists of pepper jack, provolone, and cheddar along with fluffy scrambled eggs and a crispy golden hash brown all tucked in a warm flour tortilla and served with fire roasted salsa. That sounds pretty good. We got the bag, we got the napkins, and we have the burrito. Actually pretty good size. Like I said, pretty good size burrito there. Nice flour tortilla, all wrapped up, everything in there. Let's give it a shot. Oh, it's very hot. Crunchy hash brown in there. That's about the only real texture I'm getting, of course. I mean, that makes sense. No meat or anything, just a crunchy hash brown and a whole lot of cheese. There's a look inside for you. See all that melted cheese in there? Ash brown. Nice mashup of all three of those cheeses. Just very creamy. Uh, the flavors go well together. You have a nice smooth mixture of the provolone and the cheddar together. And then you've got that bite of the pepper jack cheese. The one thing that I did notice is there's no fire roasted salsa to be had inside. It says it comes with it. So maybe it's just supposed to come on the side. But I looked in the bag. There's nothing there. I don't know if you're supposed to ask for it, but that's just kind of a condiment. That's like going and grabbing ketchup or something like that. If it says in the description that it's supposed to have it, you would think that it would be inside it, wouldn't you think? The damage on this was $3.79. A little spendy, but it is a good size burrito. I would expect that kind of price if it had some kind of meat in it, but for just cheese and hash browns, I think that's a little bit on the spendy side. On the Nerdometer, I would give the Jack in the Box triple cheese and hash brown breakfast burrito, um, I would give it a middle of the road, I like it. Made to order so it's nice and really hot and fresh and the cheeses are wonderful. The crunchy hash brown in there is really fine. I like that. Aside from all that, I am disappointed that the salsa wasn't inside. I think it would take that burrito and all that cheese to a really nice new level. A little on the spendy side which brought the rating down a little bit. As a follow-up, I did go back in and ask about the salsa. It's not included in the burrito. It's supposed to come on the side. It comes in these little containers, but they didn't offer it to me. They didn't put it in my bag. I would have had to known from the website to ask for it. So if you want that, ask for it. Uh, I did try the burrito with the salsa. It was okay, but for me, it canceled out all the nice cheese flavors, the differential cheese flavors going on. So I, I would rather do it without. Would I recommend it? Yes, I would. I think you should go out and give it a try, see what you like it. Put it down in the comments, let me know what you think. Um, I probably won't get it again, just basically because it's a little spendy for what it is. There you go, gang. Another review in the bag. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up and join me over at Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Old Nerd Reviews and become a part of the Old Nerd Crony community. Uh -huh. Also over at the website, oldnerdreviews.com and over at Old Nerd Gamer. We're playing a lot of fun games now, including Stick Bold, a dodgeball adventure. Fun stuff. See you there. You guys have a freaking awesome day. I'll see you next time. Bye now.